the moon, and the lemon. Hey, it's Brian Light back with a review you can use, hopefully the Mountain Edition. I know there's lights bouncing off. I'm just trying, experimenting. Let me know what you think, even if it, you don't like it, especially if you don't like it. So today we have a Luna Whole Nutrition Bar. This is the Lemon Zest version. I don't think I've reviewed any of these before, but if so, look up the old reviews and you can see if I've changed my mind. So this was gluten-free, non-GMO, made with organic oats. So some people don't like cereal grains. I'm kind of on the fence on oats. Now corn and wheat, I really don't think we should be eating at all. Oats, maybe. Um, make your corn and, and wheat and barley and all that into beer and, and moonshine. That's fine. So what is it we have here? And there's a long list of stuff uh, from uh, Kit Crawford, the co-founder of Cliff Bar and Company. So I don't know if this is, I guess this is Cliff Bar. Now Cliff Bar are sugar bombs. Never eat them. Um, so unless you really just want to, you know, risk diabetes, and I'm not being flippant there. I'm being serious. So we have, uh, I think it was a five grams of protein. Um, you know what it said? It doesn't say. So I don't know how much protein is in this thing. In fact, it doesn't say anything about protein. So oh, there it is. Five grams, eight grams. So we have nine grams of sugar, including five uh, nine grams of added sugar. Are you okay there, Toby? Toby's down here growling at me. Um, we have very little saturated fat. That's bad. It's only 2.25 grams. It should be 10 times that. Trans fat, polyunsaturated, 1 gram. That's the bad fats. Monounsaturated. Monounsaturated is fine. Um, but, the, but the saturated fats, what you really, really want. You have insoluble fiber uh, is 1 gram. Dietary fi fiber is 3 grams. Um, it's got an interesting list of ingredients. You have soy. You have rice flour, roasted soybeans, and this is a soy bomb too. So this really, if you are a postmenopausal woman, this actually may help. There's some research to suggest that the soy can help. You got to get the better soy, although the problem with it in the States is we don't just do the bean, they do the husk and everything else, and that's the bad part. If you're a man like me, you probably don't need the, the estrogen increase. So let's review it anyway. Oh, and it really smells lemony. So you've got, so there's, it must be the seeds and things that, that it was talking about in the ingredients that I didn't bother reading all because I can't see right now because this lights is too bright. Again, I'm experimenting. I gotta get used to something. I really wanna put these mountains in the background and it's been a, an absolute pain. So, um, but man, this is very lemony. It's got a nice looking texture, a bunch of uh, seeds it looks like. So let's see how it tastes. Texture's great. The flavor is fantastic. My only problem is the ingredients. You got a lot of soy. You got a lot of seed oil. You have rice flour. You have soy flour. You have brown rice syrup. You have cane sugar. Those two I don't really, that's not too bad. You got chicory fiber um, syrup. I'm not sure what that is. You got sunflower oil. You got vegetable stuff. This thing has got a lot of stuff you shouldn't be eating. So, it's an on-the-go snack, but if you've got other options, I would go with them. Flavor-wise, it's awesome. So Flavor-wise, it's a 9 out of 10. It's out of the park. It's got a wonderful texture, but it is full of the ingredients that have been labeled healthy. All the research shows that is bunk, and it has been known for decades. That's the bad part. So... I really, I'm like a 3 out of 10 because of the ingredients, uh, but flavor-wise, it's awesome, but you know, so is a candy bar that's loaded with sugar. Um, but it's not a lot of sugar, it's not a lot of protein, it's got a great lemon flavor, very nice, but all those seed oils and all that soy, tread, tread lightly and let me know in the comments below what you think. Uh, is there other flavors they all like this? If they're all like this, I'm going to skip them. I'm going to go on to something else, but let me know, and we will see you next time. Goodbye. I don't know where I'd put it, though. It doesn't have this. I just need a ring light. All right. Yeah, yesterday they got really irritated because I recorded some beer reviews.
And we don't have any string cheese. <clears throat> All right, if we do it this way, how obnoxious is it? There it goes. So there's 50, let's say 60%, and let's try turning the light color up just a little bit. 